What's up YouTube, this is iTweaks here and today me and Cartman are going to be showing you guys 5 essential tweaks that you guys need for your jailbroken iPod, iPad or iPhone device. Uh, the first one that we're going to jump right into is going to be BB settings. Once you've downloaded that from Cydia, then you go ahead and go into your settings and you're going to have to click on notifications in order to turn it on. You're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom, the BB settings widget is actually going to be in the not in notification center. So once it's down there you click on it turn it to on and then boom that's all you gotta do you're done so once we pull this down there it is the first little icon here is going to show your favorites and these are obviously customizable you can put whatever you want mostly used icons or anything like that and it's just really used for uh, the ease of use so you can just scroll down right on your phone and click on the icon will go straight to it next is going to be all of your running apps if it'll show there it goes and you can just scroll across and it'll show all the running apps that are, that are on your phone right now now the next one is going to be your system info and it's going to show total processes I mean there's a, there's all the data that you would really need here's your cellular carrier, Wi-Fi stuff, CP usage, memory usage, your disk usage, operating system pretty much anything that you need to look at to see what's going on it's right here in the BB settings next one is going to be like your toggles this is going to be uh, you can get rid of that flashlight app now because this little toggle right here is going to turn on your uh, your flashlight or your flash for your camera this is going to kill your uh, all your programs, going to kill your running apps. I mean, there's everything on here. You got the respring, you got the Wi-Fi, you can turn on airplane mode, Bluetooth, uh, orientation lock, 3G. I mean, every everything that you need is right here. Next thing is going to be your settings. You can turn your brightness up from down here, and and your volume right here. And this is where you can actually toggle uh, what your favorite apps you want to put on on the front screen where the star is and if you click on this little eye down here you can obviously donate or follow the Twitter uh, of the author of this application and that's pretty much, pretty much it for BB settings the next one we're going to jump right into is going to be Springtimize 2 Springtimize 2 is very good I love this app it has so many things that you can actually change and it brings a whole bunch of singular tweaks all together into one one big tweak so after you downloaded that from City, you can go into you can either get it get the icon here, or you can actually go into it from the uh, the settings menu. And if you scroll down here, Spring to My, just click on that. And I mean the possibilities are limitless here. I mean there's so many things that you can change. A couple of things. I mean there's animation, capabilities, dock, lock screen, icons. I mean so much stuff. Uh, let's just go into a couple of things and change some stuff. Let's see. I don't want to change my dock. Let's see. Icons. I mean, you can change the size of your icon. Let's do that. Let's just change it up just a little bit. Let's just go to 80% just to see the change. Let's hide that annoying newsstand. Make sure it is enabled. This is showing your hide icons down here. Uh, let's see. Status bar. Let's go to that. Custom carrier. Let's type in, that's just going to change this AT&T, let's change it to Bjorn, which is my middle name. And let's go back, let's see what else can we do, let's just, let's just do that for now. Okay, so you're going to hit reload, you're going to hit respring. Obviously it's going to respring. And the changes will have taken effect once your phone starts back up. Alright, so here it is after it's been uh, resprung, and you can tell. The icons are a lot smaller, aren't they cute? And look at the 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 carrier there. It's changed to my middle name, which is Bjorn, and pretty cool, pretty cool. All right, so that's Spring to Mize, and obviously there's a ton of stuff that I can't really just go over everything on it. This would be like a three-hour long video, but go ahead and download it from City and check it out. Mess with some stuff, and it's really awesome. I love it. I definitely definitely recommend it. Alright, so the next one that we're going to look at is going to be the Stay Opened. And basically all it does is keeps the App Store open when you download an icon, or an app, I'm sorry, from the App Store. So instead of it closing on you and going to show you that it is downloading and installing, it's just going to stay open just like that. Boom. PayPal, let's get it. Install. See and look how much, look how easy that is. I mean, let's get the red laser one too, just for giggles. So done. See, 
and it's a whole lot easier, just makes everything go a whole lot quicker, a whole lot smoother, and that is stay opened. So the next one that we're going to be talking about is going to be the uh, multi, multi con mover. Kind of hard to say. It's multi multi icon mover. Maybe that's what it is. But anyways, uh, what you're going to do is download that from Cydia, and it makes everything a whole lot easier if you just click, click, click all these goodies, and you go over, and whatever page you're on, after you've selected the icons that you want to move, if you hit the home button. Yeah, they go to that to that page. So see, they're all gone over there, and now there they are. And this, uh, that's basically all that 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 tweak does. But I mean, it makes everything a whole lot easier. You're not having to click, drag, hold to the corner, hoping why is it not moving pages? Just click on it, swipe, click, you're done. And that brings me right into my next tweak, which is the Finiboard. As you see, it didn't show all of the icon, icons, icons. I don't know what that is. Your icons. So what you're gonna have to do is scroll down. Boom, there they are. So if you go to Cydia, download Infiniboard, that's gonna give you vertical scrolling on your screen board, and you can put as many icons as you want on one page as you want. All right, guys, that's all I have for today. If you like the video, please hit that like button. Please subscribe and leave a comment. Till next time, I am iTweaks. This is my sidekick, Cartman, and we will see you later. Peace.